You just started coding. You've probably watched The Matrix. You see all this code on the screen and you're like, man, I wanna be a hacker. You look up cool programming languages and lo and behold, you stumble upon C++. Well, in this video, I'm gonna tell you that you just made the wrong choice. And if you continue down the path of C++ as your first programming language, you may never become a programmer. So let's talk about why you shouldn't learn C++ as your first programming language. While it is a powerful language and it can give you a lot of control over your computer, it's very, very, very hard to learn. And C++ is known for having its complex syntax, which can be difficult to understand for beginners. What the fuck's this say? C++ requires a solid understanding of computer architecture and memory management, which can be overwhelming for someone who's just getting started. Think of it like this. Learning C++ as your first programming language is like trying to climb Mount Everest with no prior climbing experience. It's not impossible, but you certainly don't want to do it. The biggest reason not to start out with C++, and this happens to so many people, is that you may want to give up programming altogether. You might start out excited, ready to code, ready to build the next Facebook. Then you realize that C++ is uh, very, very hard. Then just like that, you simply don't want to code anymore. Then you get older and you regret it, and by that time, it's too late. Just like how someone wouldn't start out with a difficult climb like Everest, it's important to start out with a programming language that's more beginner friendly. You have to climb the hill in your backyard before you go climb a mountain. JavaScript is a great language that we recommend for we with women. JavaScript is a great language. JavaScript is a great language that we recommend for beginners. It has a much simpler syntax, which makes it easier to read and understand. Also, it provides instant feedback, which can help build your confidence and motivation. By starting out with a beginner-friendly language like JavaScript, you can build a strong foundation in programming and gradually work your way up to more complex languages like C++. That being said, C++ is not impossible and it can be a valuable skill to have. It's used in a variety of industries, including game development, finance, scientific computing. So if you're interested in working with low-level systems like operating systems, devices and drivers, or embedded systems, learning C++ can be a valuable investment. I'm not saying don't learn it. I'm just saying you can't jump into a fast and powerful sports car without knowing how to drive it. So before you take the jump to C++ and disappoint yourself and stop coding altogether, start learning with something more reasonable. And don't get me wrong, JavaScript is gonna be frustrating too, but it will be way less frustrating than C++. So why be really, really mad when you can just be mad?